This video is going to show you how to target Facebook users based on your donor database. All right, so what do I mean by that? Facebook ads now allow you to actually create what's called a custom audience. And a custom audience is where you can actually include external data, i.e. your um, email list from your donors, let's say your active donor email list, right, which you should be able to segment on your end, you could actually target people who are lapsed donors or who are current donors, but you want to actually promote some sort of advocacy campaign to them, right? Also, you know, if you're doing some type of email marketing, right, and someone's getting email messaging, um, <clears throat> what better way to reinforce that than to take out a Facebook ad at the same exact time to reinforce that message? So this is a very powerful approach. Now let me show you how to set it up. Uh, the first thing you need to do is you actually need to install the Facebook Power Editor. And what you do is you just go to this web page right here, just on the Nonprofit Facebook Guy. It's Nonprofit Facebook Guy forward slash how to install Facebook Power Editor. Okay or you can just search in the search field. Once you have it installed, then you're going to get access to some features within Facebook's Power Editor. Once you have set this up, you can create an audience. So you click on Create Audience. You name the audience. So let's say Lapsed Donors, right? Uh, you choose your file. Basically, this is going to be a file of just email addresses. That's it. You could also use Facebook IDs or phone numbers if you have that type of list. Okay. So for example, if you do text to donate and you have a massive list of people's phone numbers, then you can use that list. But for this example, we're going to use email. We click on create. I'm not going to click create, but you click on create and it automatically creates the list. It adds it here. So I have you know, a few different lists here that I've created um, and they're going to actually show up now in the advertising tool. Okay, so you go to facebook.com forward slash ads, okay, and then you click on create an ad. You'll be redirected to this other page. Your destination can be an external URL or a Facebook page or a Facebook update, okay. In this case, we're going to use a Facebook page, okay, I'll just use Inbound Zombie. And what do I want to promote? Um, <clears throat> you know, I might want to promote the page. But what might be a little bit more interesting is if I actually promote a post, a specific post that's received a lot of interaction already. You know, that, that, that's proof that, you know, if someone else sees it, chances are they're going to engage with that update as well. Okay? So we're going to pick a specific post here. It's going to give you a preview of the ad, what it's going to look like. Right? You could also just display stories that people are creating when they interact with a specific post. So for example, I'm going to change it a little bit so that the emphasis is now on the friend network as opposed to the page. Right? So the ad is actually um, a picture of one of your friends who has interacted with that update. Okay? So we're just going to scroll down and then if we notice below choosing your audience, um, we're going to skip over a lot of this stuff because that's not the topic at hand, but within this we actually have a new area called custom audiences. Okay? Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select active email subscribers. So we could say active donors or lapsed donors, whatever that list is going to be. Okay? And what that does is that will take that email list and correlate those emails with Facebook users and then give you an estimate of the number of people that your ad will be seen by. Okay? So what's really powerful about this is that it's leveraging existing relationships that you already have with Facebook users and it's helping you connect the dots. Your donors, your lapse donors, your email subscribers, whoever it might be, and it's connecting the dots and helping you target those people with an ad. So that's how to target donors on Facebook with an ad.